Well, Brent Yell and the New Haven Police Departments are investigating after they say a Yell student woke up in the early morning hours to find a man standing in their bedroom. And this isn't the first time that something like this has happened recently. It's definitely scary. I mean, being like a young woman who lives in the area, it's unnerving. Yelp police say the incident happened just before 5.30 in the morning on July 23rd in an off-campus apartment in the area of Edgewood Avenue between Park Street and Linwood Place. Police say the intruder ran away after an altercation with the student. According to Yelp police, no one was injured and nothing was taken from the apartment. This marking the third time in the last three months alone involving a break-in involving Yale students. Back in May, a Yale graduate student was sexually assaulted while being held at gunpoint in the 300 block of Elm Street. According to police, the student was asleep when she woke up to an unknown male in her home. The suspect ran from the home after the assault, according to police. Another incident in June where police say a Yale graduate student woke up in the early morning hours to find a man in their apartment, the intruder again running away and the student uninjured. A Yale student we spoke to said he hasn't seen an increase in security yet. We get updates from Yale frequently about security and uh, crime around the area. And uh, I have not seen an increase in security in the area, but um, I'm sure once school ramps up as well, there will be more uh, security. For those who live nearby, this has them taking more precautions. We make sure we double deadbolt our door and check, make sure our, our windows are locked, stuff like that. So and we don't walk around at night by ourselves. For Olivia, the frequency of incidents in this area has her wondering if they could be connected. We live probably about a quarter mile from here, and I've seen all of them individually in the news, but nobody seems to really be connecting them. And about an hour ago, I spoke with Mayor Justin Elliker over the phone, and he told me that it is believed that there is not a threat to the general public and that New Haven police are investigating all those incidents that we just talked about. They remain under investigation tonight. Also, Yelp police reminding and urging students to keep their doors and windows locked, as well as making sure that their hedges are trimmed and their entrances are well lit. Live in New Haven, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.